folks, in this tutorial I'm going to show you how to manage hyperlinks in Excel 2010. Basically what happens is that when you enter a web address into one of the cells, it automatically converts that to an hyperlink. So if I go ahead and type in a web address and press enter, you'll notice that it automatically creates an hyperlink for me. And if I go ahead and click on this link, it will open up that page in your default browser. Now let's say you wanted to add an address and not create a hyperlink. Well, the tip to do that is that you start with a single coat and then type the address. And you'll notice that Excel did not create a hyperlink for this cell. Now, it's very easy to remove hyperlinks from a cell. So for example, let's say if I wanted to remove a hyperlink from cell B7, all I have to do is just right click and click on remove hyperlink and that should remove the hyperlink from Excel. The same is true if I wanted to create a hyperlink. If this is the address right here and I want to go ahead and create a hyperlink, all I would do is just right click, hyperlink, and then I would just type the address of what I want the hyperlink to be. And in this case, I want the hyperlink to be ndglabs.com and press OK. Now let's say if you create a lot of hyperlinks in Excel and you don't want to start your entry with a single code just so that it does not recognize your link as a hyperlink then you can change one of the options in Excel. It's one of the proofing options in Excel that will stop creating automatic hyperlinks for you. To do that you would go to File, Options, then you would go to Proofing, Autocorrect Options, auto format as you type and make sure that you uncheck the internet and network path with hyperlinks. If I go ahead and click on OK and now if I go ahead and start typing in a web address, press enter, you'll notice that it did not create that hyperlink for me. Now going back to what I said earlier, if you wanted to go ahead and manually create a hyperlink, you can right click and then go ahead and click on hyperlink and define a web address. If you want to create a hyperlink to an existing file in one of your folders or maybe a file on the network drive, all you have to do is press Ctrl K and then select the file that you want a hyperlink to and there you go. It creates that reference for you and if I go ahead and click on this link it'll ask me, well, are you sure you want to open this? Do you want to continue? could be a virus um, and if you go ahead and click on OK it will open up that file for you. 